This short video will show you how to select a dataset to work with or upload a new dataset to MarketSite. First, click here to see the datasets in your account. If you'd like to work with a dataset that's already been uploaded, browse the folders here to find it. Once you click on the dataset name, it will become your active dataset, which you can see by looking here. Now, whenever you click on variables, cross tabs, charts, and data views, you'll be working with the items created for that dataset until you select a different one. You will also be able to see the contents of that dataset in the main window. To upload a new dataset, first select or create the folder where you'd like the dataset to be located. To create a folder, select the folder where it will be created and either right click on it and choose new, then folder, or choose new from the action bar, select folder, and create the new folder. Next, right click on the folder or select it and use the action bar to upload the new dataset by selecting new and dataset. On the new dataset window, select the file to be uploaded by clicking here and selecting the file from your local computer or network. MarketSite supports all the leading file formats, including SPSS, Excel, SAS, Triple S, and several custom formats for specific survey tools such as SurveyMonkey, Qualtrics, Confirmit, and others. If you're uploading an SPSS file, all you need to do is select that file and click OK. All the data and the labels, or metadata, will be uploaded together with no need for a separate file. If you're working with other file formats, you may need to upload an additional file that contains the labels or metadata. We encourage you to review the data preparation guides in our help section for more information. Once the data set has been uploaded, you can see its contents here in the main window. You can view this summary report, automatically created by MarketSite, showing frequencies or means for every variable in the data set or you can click on the main menu items to begin working with variables, cross tabs, charts, dashboards, or data views. That concludes this video on selecting and uploading datasets.